Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Apostle Alfred Uyinusa, the man with the talk and be. Don't talk him for this video. The reason why it is support Igbo people. Make I leave you now, make you hear from Apostle Alfred. My very good people, my brothers and sisters, on a good morning. We thank God for the wonderful things we in that they do for our life. Because not only one they put road for where road not they, and not only one they talk word. When they reach. And anything we go talk, nobody will feel change. Whatever the Lord has said, no man born of a woman can stand against it. We thank God for what He's doing in our life, for our family, for our children, for our siblings and loved ones. Because Jesus is our way maker. He's the only white God. He's a God that sees the world and come to pass. This morning, I am speaking just as I am led. I deal with the evils. Why I deal with the evils? I deal with them because they be human beings. I deal with them because they be God creation. I deal with them because they be nation builder. I deal with the evils because they be nation developer. Now, lay evil man, you will go through it from desert, it will turn out to a city. I deal with the evils because they don't get interest of destroying life and property. No. Anywhere they go, they develop. Just like all uh, people from the south, people from the southern region, we are nation builder. Anywhere we go, we they develop, we they buy land, we they build, we they develop that area. Because anywhere we they go, they do business. We know they collect the land from the people. We they pay. We they do business. Those of us when they, they do into spare parts, we know they carry the gold community. They key the people when they did there. So because we want to do spare part business. No, we they buy the land, we they invest, and we they pay tax to the government. That is the reason why I they stand with the evils. Come they come re come some conscience. Why I they stand with them? Because they be nation builder. All over the country, anywhere you put Igbo man, anywhere that they do business, they, they develop that area. A black Edo man, a John Ishakiri, out uh, Yoruba, uh, and Urubo. Anywhere we go, Asia, anywhere we go, we they develop that place. We they make sure say we invest there, we they stay there. We know they go, they build one small kiosk. We build small kiosks. We come say case any eventuality, we have nothing to lose. No. We believe say anywhere we day in our house. We believe say any location where we go, our own, now to contribute our own quarter. That is the reason why I deal with the evils, come break, come some sunshine. And I'll continue to the token without fear or favor or intimidation from any quarter. Like the our brothers are also. Anywhere they go, they full and to be precise. Anywhere they go, and they know they develop. Ansa know they develop. Anywhere they go, ah yes, they will build chaos. What did they kill they do? They will sell cigar, they sell uh, uh, hot drink, they sell toothpick, they sell uh, cucumber, they sell carrots, they do shoemaker. That is what they do. So anywhere full and they, they know they develop. But anywhere they eat for my day, if they eat, not say that place, that house, it will develop out. Just like the Benin, just like the Igbos, and the Yoruba, and the Yoruba, the, the, the Asheman, the Esako, the Esan. Anywhere we did, we did develop out, we did fish in our house. Because home away from home, then be our dream. But for the Fulanese, anywhere they go, they get the mentality of destruction. They get the mentality of just go there, do business, and come back. Don't invest. That is the reason why. Elsama, yeah, 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 full animal, they don't get investment. We're we'll talking about house, where they develop. They don't get. They don't get. And yes, they will build one small house because they don't say, even that small house, no property for inside. Because they don't say they cast, they don't lose. But for the beliefs, for the evils, 
for the act for the Yoruba, for the ancient man. Anywhere we go in our house with a development, we don't get the mind of destruction. We don't get the mind of kill, kill. We get the mind of development. That is the reason why an average uh, full and man in no get house. He not get better house and they only do better work. They only do better work. That's the reason why they don't take time to invest on human capacity. But for the Igbos, they spend time to invest on human capacity. Maybe we look at Inos Moto today. Inos Moto, like an Arusa man, you go see the way all the Arusas. All the full of means, they go run around, they go invest, they go make sure that later that month they will buy. For us, we they kill ourselves, we they destroy our own empire. That is the reason why I they do this broadcast this morning as I am led. I know they talk because I want to talk. I they talk as God they move me because I will continue to stand on the path of truth. God check any city, any street. When you enter, you go must see Igbo man developing that place. Go check Iraqi, go check Wellos Peppers, go check Igun, go check Leventist, go check Forestry, go see how. Not only I go, every part of the nation, you go see Igbos bringing massive development. Because they get a mind of development, they get a mind to build, they get a mind to repair. That is the reason why. Now, only if you man you think give one error, it will turn into two error. Now, so it's be for Bini. Now, so it's be for Injo. Now, so it's be for Urubuma. Now, so it's be for uh, Yoruba man. The people of the South South, the people of the South West, the people of the South East, we believe in development. That is the reason why. Anywhere, go check the academic center. Go see, we, we get brain when they do well. But yet, some set of persons no want make we achieve our goal because of their backward mentality. An evil man prefer to invest anywhere he did. That's why the evil man will think God not. He no mind. He will build house. He knows that they want to stay. But for the full animal, man, he no will build house. He will prefer to build one chaos or the go stay forest. Or the go stay forest. That's what I mean. I deal with the Igbo. I deal with the Yoruba. I deal with the Benin. I deal with the Robos. I deal with the Eshaman. Why? Because we are nation builder. We the built nation. Because everything about us now development. Everything about us now to repair. We will talk about the technology world. Now we they dominate. Now we they dominate. Go check the automobile industry. Go check the electrical industry. Go check the mechanical industry. Now, evil people, now they they charge. And as some beneath persons, they follow. Now, some beneath people, they follow. Now, so Asian man, they follow. Now, so Yoruba man, they follow. Why? Because we get the mentality to build the nation. We don't get the mentality to destroy nation. But before now, we love ourselves. Now, when all these Fulanis come into power, why? Because they get backward mentality. They don't get the mentality to build. They don't get the mentality to develop. They don't get the mentality to invest. They don't get the mentality to invent. Now, we get the mentality to develop. Now, we get the mentality to invest. Now, we get the mentality to expand our region. That is the reason why anywhere the Igbo man there, he owns to develop that area, he owns not to expand that area. An Igbo man can never go to a community to kill them, to take over the community. No. An Igbo man will never do that. An Igbo man believes in business. That way you see one small person who are by international market, he gets 50 stores. The Igbos, they don't hold the full and of investment. Go and check the major stakeholders, players in the, in the music industry, in the film industry. They are all pioneered by the Igbos. 
Follow with the belief. The Isa, the Isaman, the Yoruba, the the the, 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 the Middle the Europe, we they work together. Why? Well, because we get the mentality to develop. How many full are in the school? But yet now they, they talk what when they reach. Why? Well, because we allow them to begin to carry out that evil agenda. Because of greed and wickedness from our people, from our so-called those who call themselves leaders and stakeholders in the society, we allow these people to begin to decide our fate. We allow these people to begin to detect what we should become. Error in the highest order. Error in the highest order. The people of the south, the people of the east, the people of the southwest, we are nation builders. That is the reason why. Anywhere we day, we they develop. We know they destroy. We know they spoil. We they develop. Then the reason why an full Fulanima can decide to invade any local government, any area to destroy because they have nothing to lose. They have nothing to lose. They have nothing to lose. If not for our so called leaders, if not for our so called greedy fathers, when he sell us out, I believe, I believe, we forgot them here with them. We them here with them today, why? Because we refuse to help ourselves. We refuse to assist our own. We refuse to join hand with our own to then build the nation. Let the evils go. Give them their own nation. Give the Midwest their own nation. Give the Yoruba their own nation. See if the nation will not develop. Nigeria is too big for one man to rule. Nigeria is too big for one man to rule. The Nigeria is too big for one man to rule. That is the reason why every one of us, we must stand beside or behind the evils. Go see the silent massacre. Where did they go right now for East? Silent massacre. When the people say ATA not a show, AIT not a show, Chinese television not a show. Silent massacre going on right now in the east, and everybody keep quiet. Go say after all, don't be my brother, don't be my sister. This is totally unacceptable. This is totally unacceptable. This is totally unacceptable. Silent massacre going on right now in the east. People are being slaughtered like chicken. Everybody will keep quiet. AIT no go swan. EPS no go swan. ITV no go swan. Why? Well, because it is not their business. It is not their business. The report that I am getting for what is going on in the east is heartbreaking. Is totally unacceptable. So I stand with the evil to say no to this massacre. I stand with all the pity, the Yoruba, the, the Aousa, and the, the Aousa here because they are not part of the calamity. The middle of the earth. To say enough is enough of this massacre. Enough of this keeping quiet. Enough of this silence. We must all rise up to condemn the act, this evil act going on in the East. And we must all speak out to say, no, every man owe you thanks, or a, a booking, owe you a, a booking to your kento. We must all stand up to say, enough is enough. When they keep quiet, they say, oh, the they put the key. They are killing eyeball. Let me tell you, an average Aousama consider everybody to be eyeball, whether you like it or not. They don't ask you, you be evil. They don't ask you, you be eyeball. They because they believe everybody in an eyeball. Take it or you leave it. They call everybody infidel. If you are not aware, you should be aware today. They call everybody from the south, from the west, from the east, infidel, little bit of infidel, unbeliever. They call everybody unbeliever. 
So this is not a time to segregate, but this is the time we need to unite to say no to this massacre of our brothers, the evils, the plague of silence. How can we express love in a nation where the leader believes more on livestock than human beings? How can we experience massive development in a nation where the leaders believe more on livestock than human beings? How can we have a meaningful development in our city, in our nation, in our land when we have leaders who believe on, life, on a livestock than human beings? Our leaders lack humanity. They don't have hearts of human beings. They have the heart of Lucifer. Our leaders they don't have the heart of, of humanity. All they do is wickedness, hatred. We must all rise up to say no to this evil act going on silently in the evil land. They don't reach east. They are already in the east. They are already in the west. They are already in the south. They are only waiting for the whistle to be blown. They will begin to carry out dangerous attack. As a secret revealer and a seer, I am able to say that they are in everywhere. They just wait for the whistle to blow. Then they wait for the whistle to blow. And when the whistle blow, you have nowhere to go. So, this is not the time to say, oh, <laughs> now let the evil be clear. The impulse are human beings. Because when they start their full massacre, they don't go ask, are you an iPod or not? For as long as people speak, I will say, you are their enemy. For as long as you cannot speak, I will say, you are their enemy. This is my submission. My submission is this. The nation is too big for one man to rule. The nation is too big for one man to rule. The Benin Kingdom is one of the first kingdoms in the history of Nigeria. I also come there. I never get the leading to speak on that. I never get the leading. I never get the right information to to speak on that. When I have the leading and the right information, I will speak on the Benin Kingdom. I will speak on the Benin Kingdom. I deal with the evils. Come rain, come sun, come shine. I deal with them. I deal with the good people of the Southwest. I deal with the good people of the Southeast. I deal with the good people of the South South. And I deal with the good people of the Middle Belt. Because we believe in development. Go Lagos. If you remove evil man from Lagos business, Lagos will crash. Take it or you leave it. Take it or you leave it. Take it or you leave it. That's the truth. Take it or you leave it. If you remove evil man from Lagos state alone, Lagos will crash. Take it or you leave it. Believe it or not. Remove evil man from Lagos State. Let me start from Lagos. Remove evil man from Lagos State. Take it or you leave it. Lagos will crash. Because 80% of the goods and services being rendered in Lagos is being supervised or coordinated by the evils. Take it or you leave it. Take it or you leave it. And this is the gospel truth. This is the gospel truth. And I hold nobody apology. And I hold nobody apology. That is to say, the Igbos are human beings and they deserve to live. The Belize are human beings and we deserve to live. The Yoruba are human beings and they deserve to live. We are not animals, we are human beings. That's the reason why anywhere we go, we develop. Like Abuja, 
Remove Igbo people from Abuja. Remove Benin. Remove the, the Yoruba from Abuja. Abuja will crash. Even if they build Abuja with our own money. Even if they're not, it being developed with our own money. Remove the Igbo man from Abuja. Remove the Benin. Remove the Yoruba from Abuja. Abuja will crash. Why? Because 90% of the massive development there, now we get out. Now we the runner. Now we the runner. Now we the runner. Into we we'll talk about sparks, spare parts business. Now the ebos. Now we the runner. Or we'll talk about building material. Now we the runner. Now we the runner. Or we'll talk about the textile cloth, textile test, industry. Now we the runner. Or we'll talk about electronics. Now we the runner. And if we decide to stop. Forget it. No, I only produce. My people, now watching, I want to talk with this. I said, they pay me, I go to talk her. On this note, everybody, we must all rally around the people of the East. At this junction, at this junction, we must all rally around them. We must all run around them. At this junction, I repeat, everybody, we must all run around the evils and say no to injustice and this secret and silent massacre. The massacre, when it happened for Rwanda, is currently taking place in the East. The massacre that took place in Rwanda is silently taking place right now in the East. Whether we like it or not. Look, see the way the, the Nigerian army, they fly that chopper. Go, 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 go. They look, why they not carry the same chopper? Enter a hall to go, re, to go stop those kidnappers. They were the Nigerian police. They move around. You are looking for high profile people to kill. Why they send Nigerian police? Don't go a hall to go deliver our people from the hands of kidnappers in the hall. In the hall. Why they send? Nigeria police, the Nigeria army, where we not enter a home to protect life and property and to stop the kidnapping of our people in the hall. You are looking for ESF members, you are looking for I you are looking for IPOC members. Why on a not go into why not go forest to go stop the kidnapping of our people in the hall? In the hall. Anyway, now we do not plan to not read. My good people, this is the message I have this morning. I pray that God will continue to defend every one of us. And we will continue to stand on the path of truth. We will continue to stand on the path of truth. We are not afraid, we are not intimidated. Because our life is in the hands of God. Beloved, let us join hands together. Let us stand with the evils. To stop this massacre before it will be too late. Before it will be too late. Let us stray her together to stop this silent and secret massacre going on right now in the East before it will be too late. This is my submission. God bless every one of you. Long live all the good people of Nigeria. Long live all the good freedom fighters. Long live those standing on the path of truth. But death shall locate the evil personality irrespective of their religion, irrespective of their political affiliation. But I know freedom will get it. Freedom is now or never. You don't you don't you, you don't buy freedom, you fight for it. You ask for it and you fight for it. You don't big freedom for street. We must all rise up to demand for freedom from the oppressors. We must all rise up to demand for freedom from the hands of the oppressors. I stand with the evils. I stand with the adults. I stand with the people of the Southwest. I stand with all the good people of Nigeria that believe in development and massive productivity. 
I stand with them. God bless every one of us. Shalom. I beg, help us share this video and let us know what you think for comment session. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the year all the things where they happen for Nigeria. Make I leave you now with this video, make you help us share up. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.